Hi guys, so I've had a lot of people ask me to do a hair tutorial um, on basically how to curl my hair. Um, so here it finally is. I hope you guys like it. Yeah, so if you want to know how to how I do my hair, then please keep watching. So basically what I do to get my curly hair, naturally I already have wavy hair, so it's not very challenging um, for me to curl my hair. Um, but whenever I get out of the shower, sorry, you guys can see some dye in my forehead. So if you're wondering what the heck that is, it's just color from when I got my hair to eat. So, um, when I get out of the shower, the only things that I put in my hair are the Big Sexy Hair Root, um, Plump, Pump Plus, Root Pump Plus, and then, um, just this Matrix Total Result, um, Miracle Treat. I've talked about these in a couple videos. Um, but yeah, that's all I do when I get out of the shower. I just put those in my hair. What I use for shampoo, I just use um, a smoothing shampoo by Matrix. But I would say if you have um, like pretty flat hair, then maybe go for something that's going to add volume. But like I said, it's not very hard for me to get my hair curled. Um, so that's what I do when I get out of the shower. And then once I get my hair um, dried... Um, this is the barrel size that I use. I don't even know what size this is. Just like, not like the tiny, tiny one, but it's a smaller one. And then I got my bigger one. But for this look, I'll only be using this one iron. Um, so I use this. And then, um, I should say though, <laughs> before I start curling my hair, I like to spray Batiste in my hair. This is the Floral and Flirty Blush. This is Batiste Dry Shampoo. It's this kind, but um, there are other scents or whatever. I don't know. Okay. So that's what I use, um, before I start curling. And then when I'm done, I put my big sexy hair, um, spray and play harder. So really yeah. how I get my hair curled. It's pretty a simple way. I mean, I just grab small parts of my hair. I really don't like go too crazy about, um, like separating like a ton of sections I kind of just grab and curl and every time I curl I literally just curl away from my face every time I never curl um, in towards my face I mean I have and sometimes once in a while I do but for the most part I just these are my curls I just curl away from my face I usually try to hold for about like 10 seconds at least and when I'm um, pulling the curl out, I kind of let it sit on the end for a minute. This time I didn't even spray any Batista in my hair. Usually I do, but I didn't. I probably will though. I'll probably end up spraying it in my hair. So yeah. I mean, this is all it really is to it. I mean, I really don't... There's really no like special thing that I do. Oh, and also, um, when I part my hair, um, lately I've been parting it in the middle, but my part is over here because I have a cowlick right here, but I've been parting it in the middle lately. So yeah. So before I start to work my way like around, I like to just take my hairspray and um, spray what I've already got done in the front just so it doesn't really fall out and it kind of just holds. Um, I kind of sometimes um, kind of tweak my hair a little bit. I like to either do that or take um, just a little comb and kind of tease it a little and spray it. And there's really, that's really all I do. Basically, this is all that I do on like the back side of my head. Just picking up all these pieces and curling them the same way. I don't like super tight curls. I like them to be a little loose. kind of hard to curl my hair under right now so I really haven't been just because my hair is getting so long in the back so yeah I definitely can't curl it under but and this is all that I do and I 
I just grab it and I like twist it like that and I kind of just fluff it a little. Spray some Batiste in here. This stuff is just awesome for volume. I love it. It smells really good too. Yeah, like this is all that I really do. Just kind of, um, I just basically, I say like I wave my hair, but then I just spray some Batiste or hairspray on it. I just like grab it and curl, fluff it with my fingers. Some parts I always notice, like need to be um, touched up a little bit, so I just grab them and curl them quick. But yeah. And that's all that I do. And now I'm going to show you guys um, how I do it when I part it in the middle to touch it on this side. But we'll touch it up. But this side looks a little funky. But that's because I have a cowlick right here. And because my color is kind of split now into two ways. So I'm just going to try and make it work on this side. Now when I do my hair and like split it in the middle, I really like to take my Batiste then go under each side with it. Because I like to fluff it up a little bit. Oh my gosh. I look like, um, I don't know what I'm thinking of. Some Frankenstein's wife or something. I don't freaking know. <laughs> okay, so now I'm just going to take this piece right here. This is always like the first piece that I take if it's not this side. And I just grab it, curl away from my face. I just feel it. If it's hot, then I let it go. And then I grab these hairs and curl like this, just out toward, away from my, not towards my face, away from my face. And yeah, I mean, that is pretty much it. That is all that I do for my hair. So yeah, I think that's just about the finished look. I mean, I've just got like these pieces over here to do, and then I've just got to um, I just got to do the back. I didn't I didn't show you guys how I do the back just because I figure you guys won't even be able to see it anyway. So yeah, and then after I just kind of play with it and fluff it up a little bit, then I just take my hairspray and I spray it on. And voila, that is it. You guys don't have to wear your hair this fluffy. You can wear it a little calmer if you want. It just depends on how you want to do your hair. But if you want your hair like this, then maybe go pick up these products. They might help you. And just get the same size barrel that I have. Like I said, I don't even know what size this is. I completely forgot. But pick yourself up something maybe this small, depending on, it just depends on the length of your hair, I think, though, too. I feel like um, people with really long hair can get um, kind of curls like this size with even a big barrel. So I don't know. It just depends on your hair length. And I don't know. It's all about preference, I guess. But um, if you want to pick these products up, I'll go ahead and list all of the products that I used below, um, even my curling iron. I'd I've had this thing so long that I don't even know where I got it um, or how much it was. So, But I'll go ahead and list all these products below and the prices and where I got them. And um, because I got these things, though, at Salon Centric, except for this, but all the, the red or the Big Sexy Hair and the Matrix, I picked those up at Salon Centric. I'll go ahead and um, put the price for those at Salon Centric below. But um, anywhere else you can get them, I'll, I'll put down there. So... Just look down there. I hope you guys enjoyed this and um, maybe can do this with your hair um, if you wish. But um, thanks for watching this and I hope you liked it and I'll talk to you guys next video. Bye.